Hi guys, my name is Oliver Eaton and welcome to BBC Premier League Predictor here on Oliver Eaton on YouTube. We are at week 27 and as we see on the screen now we've got some big cracking games to be predicting. But as always we will start with week 26 results uh, and we're staying consistent. We've got another 70 points here uh, that consists of one exact score and three correct results. Here's where all the points came. A big 40 came at the Bournemouth v Stoke City match. Our tens were from Leicester, Man United, and also Arsenal, Everton. Uh, so that means in the Eton League 2, the battle is still going on. We're still battling for the top 10. Hiller still top, looking set to take the crown as well. And is quite active. Matlock Town drawing with Daniel. Very, very competitive in the top 12. All right, anyway, let's get into week 27 predictions. And we'll see what you guys have. Also, so the big London derby. I've gone for a 2 1 Tottenham win. Now, Arsenal have been under quite a bit of stress uh, lately. They're losing key matches, and that Tottenham they had all right to come back against Liverpool. I think 2 1 to the home side, Harry Kane to score both. Everton v Palace, I've gone 2 0 Everton again. Another team has had a rough patch lately. Everton uh, definitely had a rough patch, didn't they? But I think at home they might reset again. Theo Walcott and all that. I think they uh, will beat Crystal Palace, who are pretty much safe. Stoke v Brighton, a definitely a relegation match. I've actually gone for 3-1 to Stoke. Now, I know I'm so cruel to Brighton, and they did so well against West Ham. Uh, I just don't think they'll win this new-looking Stoke. Hopefully, this is a draw for my sake, then. Swansea versus Burnley. I've gone for a 1-0 draw. Swansea have picked up an excellent form. I saw them win 8-1 the other day. Uh, Burnley, they've not been on the best forms either lately. Uh, so I think this is where two sides kind of meet. Burnley getting dragged down. Swansea going up 1-1. West Ham v Watford, the mid-table derby as well. 2 one to West Ham. I think West Ham have been much improved under David Moyes. Watford have really slipped down. Marcus Silva's gone. I'm not even sure who their manager is, but 2-1, uh, I think, is a fair score. Man City versus Leicester City. I've gone for a routine 3-0 win. Leicester, uh, you know, they've slipped a bit. Real Mahrez is nowhere to be seen. Man City, they're lucky to just try and win the title now, really. Just get closer to getting confirmed. So 3-0. Huddersfield Town versus Bournemouth. We've gone for a 2-1 home side win. Confidence has been gained with our 4-1 away win at Birmingham. And it has been a downward slope for us Terriers. But I feel Bournemouth, although we lost 4-0, I think will be positive atmosphere again. And we should go through that 1-2-1. One. One. Newcastle versus Man United. I've gone for 2-0. Man United only beat Huddersfield two goals to nil. Uh, and I think Newcastle will play the same technique. At home as well, I think it will limit Man United, who are not as fluent as Man City, but uh, they're getting the goals. And then Liverpool B team versus Liverpool, 3-0 to the A team. Uh, I think they'll beat their Liverpool players off tomorrow. Uh, standard Salah to get most of the goals there, I think. But 3-0, uh, I think, standard score against a struggling Southampton. And then Chelsea versus West Ham score. Right, thank you guys for watching, if indeed you still are. I'll see you next week in week 28, but for now, bye-bye.